Correlation does not equal causation. I mean, you know, you had asparagus last night and, and then you hit the command. So clearly eating spaghetti asparagus means the command doesn't work. You know, you gotta wait until you digest the asparagus. Obviously. Duh. Asshole. You are an asshole. I hate you so much. You are a stupid, dumb, bird, dumbass, dumb, stupid, dumb, birdie, dumb, dumb, bird, dumb thing. Down! Thank you! God! <laughs> hate those things. Hate them. And I have a high agility, too. Really high agility. be better to grind in an area where those things don't exist. Like, I'm pretty sure I could fight everything in that busted up town. No problem. Uh-oh. Are you serious? <sighs> what the hell, dude? This game is being a total jerk. Total freaking jerk! This isn't a safe grind anymore. It's just it's just not a safe grind. I need a better grind. I need a I need a more reliable pack of mobs to kill. It's just this just isn't it. It just isn't it. I need like the wraiths and stuff, but not the star wyverns. That's what I need. I need the rays and the, the werewolves, but no star wyverns. No star wyverns. Son of a bitch. Pretty sure Coconut, my cat, is descended from Star Wyverns. Pretty sure, anyway. He's just always there to annoy you when you least expect it. get a kill. We cannot. You know, I'm not getting any... I'm, I'm getting the enemies I want right here and Metal Slimes. So maybe I should grind here. Like, this is the only place I've ever seen a Metal Slime was right in here, so... Yo, nice. No! Nice. There we go. 115. Yeah, not super great XP, but hey, dude, these metal slimes have got a pretty, pretty good spawn rate right here. This might be the place. It's very rare to get a metal slime kill in this game because you basically have to crit it. Cute chat awakes. 
What do you I I yeah? Okay. I missed the killing blow, so I get put to sleep for a million years. Yeah, see, I'm only getting like 10 XP less, but the, the battles are way more reliable. Way more reliable. Just getting rid of those dang Star Wyverns. can't, Psycho Sheep. And also it doesn't count, even if I'm vodcasted. <clears throat> like, I'm asleep. What am I supposed to do? Just wake up and then give ten subs? Uh, uh, not to mention, like, it's like double the stream time where you can just sit there and, like, modulate phase the whole time. It's just not, it's not, no. First off, the bot doesn't work when I'm not live. Anyway, so, yeah. These guys are really great because they cast Stop Spell, which I have no care in the world, even if it hit me. Becky! Let me smash. You? Yeah. Dude, I've already, like, I, I that, that whole time up there, struggling with those damn wyverns, I got a thousand XP. Down here, already got another thousand XP. Jack Paul, while I'm not live on Vada Vodcast, you have to gift 10 subs. <laughs> nice. Batman wasn't invented yet to clean the slime up of Gotham City. I'm sorry I can't promote you to super mod. It doesn't exist. When you nail the elusive 15 pyramid. Stop kissing my butt, VG! Thank <laughs> you. 
I think this like, I think this thing has a high evasion. Yep, yep, definitely high evasion. I've gotten really lucky, I guess, in hitting him before, but not this time. Or maybe I just got unlucky there. Just die. Hey, you listened. <laughs> Check the Twitch rankings. Viewer mod, girlfriend, super mod, broadcaster, cat. Sounds about right. Let me smash! One... Two... Oh, Come on! Just let me kill ya! It'll be fun! Yes, Ken can ban streamer anytime by pulling Ethernet cord. Actually, it's the power cord to the, the the router. Power cord to the router is what he did. That lovable little ball of fluff. <laughs> I love you, kitty. Hey, Stalker, what's up? Just power. Yeah, there you go. Hey, what's up, Sammy? What's going on, dude? Ow. <laughs> Bonk. Bonk. Something tells me that I'm not going to beat the game in the next hour. <laughs> Although I can go a little bit later tonight because uh, the session will not start with me necessarily. But it, I mean, it could go both ways. So if I if I get close to beating the game, then I can. But I have an hour left. I have an hour left at least. So wait, the triple modulating phase. Who hit it? Oh yeah, you did. There it goes. Nice, Rot Bear. Nice. GG, dude. GG. We almost have a level up here, though. 350 XP.
Generally speaking, each level grind has only taken... What, like... 20 minutes or so each level, so it's not that bad. Uh, you'll just have to find out and see what happened. You'll just have to find out and see. It's a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Alright, you know what? I've been doing PP dance for a little bit. I gotta just use the restroom real quick. Give me, give me a minute. That's better. I mean, I could get, I could just go through the last dungeon and run through er away from everything, but I'm pretty sure the final boss has like. 150 HP or something, so unless I crit, I'm just gonna die. And I'll probably only end up doing 10 per hit, you know? <sighs> sure, I could run. Yeah, I know, right? Star Wyverns. Star Wyverns. Well, it's not as beta as the FF7 randomizer right now. The thing's a freaking mess, dude. Total mess. Total absolute mess. It's honest, like I said, the randomizer is a total mess for FF7. It, it's just a bunch of like everything is randomized and no quality of life whatsoever. It's just kind of, it's kind of trashy, honestly. It's kind of trashy. I don't know if it's meant to be a beta version of it where the people are testing it out to see what needs to be done, but I don't think it's very good. I 
I would really like to gain this level before I head back, but I'm low on MP. Sounds more like an alpha version, you know, honestly. Kinda- Oh, I touched my crit! Asshole! No, I'm gonna die! Okay, I didn't die, but holy crap! Jerk dies my freaking crit! I would really like to not have to go back before I level up. And I have to save, I have to... <sighs> Come on. I'm getting totally screwed over. I'm going to have to go back before I can level up. I I have to. I'm out. Of, I'm out. I have to. What a jerk game, dude. 90 XP from level. But I, I don't have the resources to maintain my position there anymore because I got a, I cut a few really, really, really unlucky encounters in a row. Really unlucky encounters. I mean, I'll pretty much have to kill slimes because <laughs> that's what I'll fight until I can get out of here again. You have, like, you can't save anywhere else. Ugh, this is really annoying. Really annoying right now. Like, I had a really nice, sustainable place there, and then I just get a few encounters in a row, which are really, really unlucky, and they just freaking drain me completely dry. asshole. Just play on switching and it's safe anywhere. Yeah, but it doesn't restore my lost MP. Well, think about it this way, Q. If something releases bad as a poor release, not a lot of people are going to be interested in playing it. So, you have a poor release, you know, you don't get a lot of attention to it. It goes away. Even if you fix it, people will be like, ah, oh, yeah, I played it. It wasn't good. Oh, but they fixed it. Eh, I'm over it. You know, kind of thing. If you release a good version of it, people are going to be all about it. Sure, yeah, it's getting a lot of attention right now, but I think without a, without that quality of life and balance, it's going to fall off fast. It's just fun to start the game with, like, you know, Ultima Sword or whatever. Yeah, pretty much Q, yeah. That's, that's, that's basically it, right? Let's see how fast they can fix all the nonsense, the bugginess, the locks, the quality of life, the fun factor, and uh, see if it delivers in time to make people want to keep playing it, basically. I feel like that box behind this dude down here is Erdrick's sword. Also, I'm pretty sure I might need Erdrick's sword because like, you know, that guy's like, you, you can't pierce the dragon scales with that weapon. Don't even bother. So, uh, I think I need to get the sword now that I think about it. But then again, maybe the game is just saying like, yeah, you know, it's, Got enough attack power to get through. Oh, come on. Now you're gonna do this to me, video game? Now you're gonna give me these damn gold golems when I don't want them at all? <laughs> you're so... A jerk! Jerk game, mean, bad, no! Bad, no game, no, jerk! Jerk, you, bad! Thank you. Twenty-eight 
25 experience. And of course I get a gold golem again. You gotta be kidding me, man. When I was grinding gold, I begged for these things and I never got them. But now that I, oh, I have no use for gold, it's like, hey, how about those gold golems you've been wanting, huh? We've been, ha we've been hanging on to them for you, buddy. Two experience from level up. Thanks. <laughs> At least I'll level up anyway. No power. No power. Oh my god. Zero power. But eight speed, so really good. Eight hit points. Mana by five. New spell. Oh, finally! Still 3,000 experience again. Basically, the game is saying this is the end of the game. 3,000 experience for every, every level. I love the cute chat. It's just one of those like shopkeeper items that you're just never gonna get or something. Finally got heal more. Let's uh let's brave the dungeon and see what happens. Let's see if we can put this game to bed today. Today. I guess I could repel, right? But these things aren't dangerous, so I don't want to waste my MP. That's kind of like with the, the game that I made. I put a, an ultimate weapon in a chest in the very first town behind an NPC that never moves. So if, if like, you ever figure out a way to glitch, over there, you could get the item and be OP. Either that or I made it empty and I said the NPC said the most powerful weapon in the game exists behind me and then I made it empty. I think. I can't remember now what I did. I definitely did some trolley stuff, though. 